Assalamu alaikum ninjas, welcome back, welcome back, it's your tech ninja Muhammad. So this is the battery drain test on fanatic mode activated, the Wi-Fi is only uh, on and we can also put the brightness at 50%, check it, check it out ninja, this is what I'm doing with the flagship devices, well the devices but also I'm using a GFX tool which I enabled the maximum maximum graphics HDR extreme realistic and full HD resolution, remember that, not 720 but full HD 1080p resolution, I'm gonna wait until the battery drops to 99% and then from there we're gonna calculate how much the battery will drain for a half hour of the gaming, of course I'm gonna not gonna show you the gameplay, I'm gonna just pass, probably fast forward it, fast forward it or maybe just pause it camera or so on or so on and so on and so on if you are interested in watching a gameplay there is on my youtube channel a special exclusive gameplay i'm gonna put the bright uh, the sound speaker volume at 85 percent same what i'm doing with the rest of my smartphones OnePlus 7 Pro with the Fnatic mode is, there you go, 99% it's 1132, 1132, so till 12.02, uh, we're gonna play it till 12.02. Fnatic mode is insanely optimized, I can't believe what OnePlus 7 is, uh, OnePlus company is doing, man. They, it's, they are, it seems that they are attacking, they also put it the front face and cameras, they put it to 4000 mAh battery, high refresh rate, they, it seems that they don't want to produce a gaming device, they want to add all these features in a commercial smartphone. Smart move, smart move, you have to admit that it is a smart, smart move. I don't know, maybe in the future they're gonna make a special gaming device because gaming devices still have uh, obviously more features. Some of them are gimmicky, some of them are useful, some of them maybe not that useful. But check it out bro, check it out. Anyway, oh, they, they didn't saw me, man. Oh no! <laughs> Can you just, we have left just one minute, I think. So yeah, half minute, half minute. So in that period, I'm gonna just test here the temperatures. Oh my God, 47 degrees, Ninjas. Oh my God, bro. 48, 48. Oh my God, this is crazy. This is the hottest smartphone that I had, at least from the flagship world. 48, this can go 48, bro. 48 Celsius. That's a lot, bro. I think the battery will be sacrificed a little bit, man. 4, 47, 47 and a half, 40. Can we get 48? Come on, give me 48. <laughs> I shouldn't cheer for a higher temperature, come on. Such a bad boy. Bad boy, bad boy. What you gonna do? Okay. And uh, yeah, that's it. Let's go immediately. It's 81%. It's 81%. For half hour, 81%, you can see it over here. I'm gonna just go to the battery, 81%, view detailed uh, usage, let's see here, used for 32 minutes. Uh, okay, because uh, you know, I, I, two minutes uh, at the startup of the video, that was for the intro. And we're gonna go quickly to AIDA64, just check here the thermals, 63, 58, 59. 55 this is these are the temperatures of the thermal let's just go down the battery 44 celsius hot ninjas it is overheating it is overheating it's not around 40 it's 47 48 celsius over here the back i don't need to show you i showed you in my gameplay that the back doesn't overheat more than the front so there's no point of me uh, checking the temperatures of the back 
if some douchebags are saying, Oh my god, why did you test just on the front? It's more hotter on the back. It's not Ninja, it's more hotter on the front. Uh, I have that on my special PUBG gameplay of the OnePlus 7 Pro, so check it out. Anyway, so let's calculate right now for half hour, that's 18%. That's 18% for half hour, so basically at 36% for one hour, Ninjas. You're not gonna even get three hours. You're not gonna even get three hours, I don't know, 36 and 36, so that's 70... 2 plus 36, so let's see here, yep, says 70, 28, 8, 1, yep, you're not gonna even get 2 hours and 50 minutes tops, ninjas, around four, 2 hours and 40 minutes to 2 hours and 50 minutes tops uh, for PUBG screen on time. Okay, see myself, that's less than 3 hours screen on time. Uh, example, Black Shark can give you 1 hour more, ninjas. Black Shark can give you 1 hour more, Black Shark doesn't overheat as the as the uh, OnePlus 7 Pro Ninjas. This is very interesting. This is honestly very, very interesting. And I'm gonna do CPU throttling test. Uh, I think that, uh, I'm sure that both OnePlus 7 Pro and the Black Shark won't uh, throttle. They are not throttling Ninjas. I will make a, sep a special video for that one, so please make sure to watch it till the end. But for now, uh, we do get, just a minute, we go, uh, both of the devices, Black Shark and OnePlus 7 Pro, do have a 4000 mAh battery. Uh, I have to admit that, uh, yes, OnePlus 7 Pro does have this 90 Hz screen. I'm gonna even redo this video with the 60 Hz uh, refresh rate, Ninjas. I will just show you right now, uh, display, check it out. So this was on 90 Hz. I'm gonna probably redo this battery test with the 60 Hz uh, refresh rate option. And I'm gonna leave it as it is on full HD plus with because this is like generally the mainstream resolution for the gamers if you have a flagship device. Some people even lower the, re uh, the resolution in the PUBG with the GFX tool to HD plus resolution. But anyway, you get the point here. I think you get the point, yeah? Remember, we had only Wi-Fi activated and screen brightness at 50%. That everything else was deactivated. I mean, the Fnatic mode was on so it did uh, turn everything in the background. But this is a beast, Ninjas. Maybe you don't get the best battery life for the gamers. Black Shark still the number one right now in the world it's, uh, that I noticed. That offers some Gigan 855 an amazing, amazing performance and still really great battery. Three and a half, th three and a three hours and forty minutes to three hours and fifty minutes. Black Shark two. So it gives you Black Shark gives you one hour more, Ninjas. I'm gonna even make probably a, a kind of uh, maybe a split screen video in the same video so you can see myself the results of those two flagship devices. Anyway, the buying links will be in the description. Honestly, I'm highly, highly uh, surprised, uh, overwhelmed by the OnePlus 7 Pro. Some small minor bugs which I have with the camera, the optical stabilization. I don't know why it's not working properly. I don't know, maybe, I don't know, maybe it's a bug of this Oxygen OS, who knows, of this unit or so. Assalamu alaikum ninjas, welcome back, welcome back. So this is the part 2 battery drain test with the OnePlus 7 Pro, but right now using the 60 Hz display mode. Previously, if you checked my part 1 battery drain test, I used the 90 Hz, uh, of course, mode so just to see what is kind of difference in the battery drainage. Uh, also, right now, I'm gonna do also a, probably another video regarding the Quad HD and Full HD difference while playing PUBG. We'll see how that will look like, so please make sure to stay tuned for that one. And right now, again, the same Wi-Fi only activated. Also, we have the Fnatic mode activated, you can see by itself. And the screen brightness is around 50%. Also, the speakers will be around 85%. I'm gonna just... Yeah, that's it. Anyway, stay tuned. Remember, this is 4000 mAh power battery and this is also Chinese international version of OnePlus 7 which I have with the Oxygen OS latest update. Yep. And I have to say again that this is gonna be for half hour, which we will note in a minute. Okay, just 99% and it's, let's check it out, it's 305. 305 till 335. Half hour exactly, so let's play it now. I can tell you ninjas that I can feel the difference between 60 Hz and 90 Hz in real life. You can feel it ninjas, honestly. If you have a really great vision and if you use a lot of smartphones uh, in your life or something like that, you can see the difference in between 60 and 90 Hz. Again, it's not a drastic, drastic difference there, but you can see it. I don't know, the OnePlus done in something like that with the software optimization to feel it like that, to behave like that, but honestly, in real life, you can see, feel the difference. Uh, I'm talking basically like uh, scrolling around, opening the apps, typing, etc, etc. Uh, regarding the UI, it just looks more smoother if you activate the 90Hz display mode. 
chairs, mate. Ninjas, I'm not gonna show you the whole uh, gameplay. Nobody can, will watch half hour battery drain test. Uh, most of you will play, uh, check a little bit, few minutes, and then you're gonna just probably go to the end of this video to check the results of the battery drain. Hey, man, man, I'm here, I'm here. Very smooth, very smooth indeed, but I prefer the 90 hertz display modes. This fluid display. I will make a, uh, I will make a comparison. PUBG 90 hertz, 60 hertz, uh, the smoothness. I will make that. You will see the difference by yourself. Remember, I'm using a GFX tool, 60 FPS, full HD plus resolution. Option for X analyzing, shadow is activated. Such a beast, oh my god. This one why well, OnePlus is one of my favorite brands. Just love the smoothness of the oxygen OS. The Android skin is just the beast of the beast. Also, we're gonna test here the heating on the end. Please make sure to watch it. Um, I can Sucker! That was a great kill. So with the 90 Hertz, the display was overheat. I think it was overheating at 48 Celsius, Ninjas. Let's check it now. And I will show you after 15 minutes. This is right now, let's see here, 44 Celsius with the 60 Hertz display mode. Refresh rate 45, 45 ninjas, 44 point, yeah, 45. Oh my god, just after six minutes of the gameplay, 45. Anyway, we're gonna see how it's gonna heat after half hour. So let's fast forward everything or just pause the video. Okay, we are back. We are back. We have, I think we have three minutes more to play this game. Until half hour. Yeah, I have three minutes more. Check it out, Ninjas. Uh, so before we finish this uh, video, this gameplay, I will show you right now. Oh my God. Allah, 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 Akbar. Ninjas, this is the record. I can't, honestly, I can't believe that this device, this is the record. This is the first time I'm seeing this kind of temperature. Oh my god, Ninjas, 52 Celsius. What? What, man? Oh my god, this is completely crazy. OnePlus will need to work on more. I'm having the Chinese version with the Oxygen OS. I don't know what other reviewers are doing. Uh, is this is this reported on YouTube? This issue, 52 Celsius. This is uh, insane, ninjas. This is unacceptable in my opinion. Xiaomi Mi 9, I think, was 47 a maximum, but this is five Celsius more. 
crazy, man. Where is he hiding? Anyway, you will put ninjas, you will put, of course, uh, you will put a case on your smartphone so you're not gonna feel this temperature this much. But check on the back, uh, on the back there's like 4 Celsius difference. The maximum that you can see on the back is 48 Celsius ninjas. But on the front, again, 52.5. Oh, oh my god, 53 ninjas, I think we can go to 53. Yeah, that's almost 53 Celsius there. This is the first time I'm seeing this kind of overheating on any on any flagship ninjas. Anyway, uh, let's try to uh, we're gonna try to just basically just so just minute and a half more. Let's check it out. 3:34. So we're gonna play it till 3:35. Just one minute more, ninjas. Oh my God, I can't believe that this device is overheating. This is the first time I'm seeing. I repeat again. This is a con. I mean, honestly, this is a con, and I don't know how in the heck. I th I suppose that uh, I suppose that uh, it will overheat more on uh, 90 hertz, but it's not ninjas. It's uh, the otherwise other hand. Basically, it's like a different case there, a different scenario. It heats more on 60 hertz display mode. How to explain this? This is also probably kind of a software bug or so. But maximum that I saw with the 90 hertz was 48 Celsius. With the 60 Hz, it's 53 Celsius. 5 Celsius difference. I don't know how to explain this bug, this difference, why it's different like this. It's basically normally uh, thinking logically there, it should uh, heat less on 60 Hz display mode. So I don't know how to explain this thing, just anyway, 35 Celsius there, let's see here, it's 79 Celsius, Ninjas, it's 79 Celsius, uh, sorry for that, not 79 Celsius, it's 79% of the battery, so basically 20%, exactly, 20% for half hour, Ninjas. We're gonna go quickly just to AIDA 64 and go to the thermals, and uh, yes, you can see by self here, let's go to the battery, 47 Celsius. We had with the 44 Celsius, we had with the 90 Hertz display mode. So it's like three, four Celsius difference. I don't know how to explain this thing. I'm not that technical and I'm not that uh, kind of super, super smart geeky guy to explain you and to know exactly because I'm not uh, basically the guy who uh, produced this device, who created this device and I'm not one of those people who uh, assembled all these uh, things. But uh, let's go back to uh, just a minute to the battery here Battery usage view detail usage PUBG 34 yeah, if we of course mention because before that I've been waiting until the battery drops to 99% So yes, exactly half hour playing PUBG. It took 20% of the battery in just remember with the GFX tool maximum graphics HDR extreme mode Analyzing 4x so it will take 40% for one hour ninjas uh, So basically you're gonna have around two and a half hours screen on time ninjas maximum two and a half hours screen on time uh, with this result ninjas Again, not that satisfied not that satisfied. I don't know why we don't have a better again uh, I have to admit that this is on maximum graphics, but for the 4,000 milliamp hour battery black shark ha gives you better Black Shark gives you ninjas uh, 3 hours and 45 minutes of uh, screen time. Again, which is really odd, uh, 90 Hz display mode will give you slightly better, but, uh, slightly better uh, screen on time. Again, crazy thing, I don't know how to explain this thing. It, it shouldn't, be, uh, shouldn't be different, man, it should be a different case. It should, this one should uh, drain less, but it's otherwise. I don't know how to explain this thing, ninjas. Anyway, you're gonna, I'm gonna have a separate video where I'm gonna do a split screen, a battery comparison, and you will see the results by yourself. For now, this is just exclusively one single video regarding PUBG on 60 Hz display, Fnatic mode with the OnePlus, 6, uh, OnePlus 7 Pro. Uh, let's just, yeah, you can see by yourself, Fnatic mode is activated. I'm not, I'm, maybe I'm gonna even do a gaming versus Fnatic mode difference if I find free time. But I will make for sure Quad HD versus Full HD uh, battery comparison with the OnePlus 7 Pro. It does have a huge battery, uh, it does have a huger, bigger screen display uh, in compared to the Black Shark and Xiaomi Mi 9. It is slightly bigger. Remember, because it, it's like even, you see by itself, it's a huge, this device is huge, it just, it's almost like a phablet. It's almost a phablet, it's almost 6.8 inch screen. Anyway, 
I love 1.7 Pro Ninja, it's such a great beast, you get a sustained performance, I'm gonna also do a CPU throttling test, so please make sure to watch uh, my other videos. For now, what I'm not satisfied, it is this overheating issue, this is the first time I'm seeing 53 Celsius Ninjas, 53 Celsius. On a commercial smartphone, I never saw this. Maybe four years ago when we had the issue with the Snapdragon 800 series 801 and 808, if you remember those smartphones. But in the last two and a half years, this is the first time I'm seeing the, these kind of temperatures on a flagship commercial smartphone. My salam is here until next time. Remember, buying uh, links will be below $645 for the 6GB RAM variant, $670 for the 8GB RAM variant with 256 gigs of storage, which I'm having right now. This is the most expensive version which I have uh, right now available uh, globally. My salam, peace. Buying links below. Have you ever wondered where to buy smartphones from? Chicka chicka ching 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 China! That is the gearbest.com and banggood.com, the most reliable two sites for online buying. Use my promo links below in the description to purchase anything ninjas. That's the best way to support me. Let's go!